Joe Gao, the former chancellor of the University of Wisconsin, La Crosse, said he's weighing legal action after being fired over pornographic videos he made with his wife, raising the potential of a debate over free speech in the workplace. I would say that anything that I do or my wife and I do, we do as citizens in the United States, who have the freedom of First Amendment to the Constitution, to create and publish books and videos that explore consensual adult sexuality, Gao told the Milwaukee Journal Sentinel, noting he didn't regret the videos. Rothman, the university's president, called Gao's conduct, abhorrent, and told the Associated Press that Gao incorrectly believes that the First Amendment gives him a free pass to say or do anything that he pleases. The University of Wisconsin System Regent President Karen Walsh said, the outrage over his behavior is evidenced by the unanimous vote by the UW Board of Regents to terminate him as Chancellor. She added, we are alarmed, and disgusted, by his actions, which were wholly and undeniably inconsistent with his role as Chancellor. As a tenured faculty member, Gao still remains employed by the university, but will no longer serve as Chancellor. Rothman, the university's president, said that Gao would be placed on administrative leave as he transitions into a faculty role. But he noted that he's filed a complaint with the new interim chancellor Betsy Morgan regarding his tenure status. He also noted that an outside law firm is investigating the matter. Gao told the Associated Press he had already planned to retire from the chancellor position at the end of the 2024 semester with intention of transitioning to teaching communications courses. It's not the first time that Gao has had a public free speech standoff with university officials over porn. In 2018, the school system reprimanded him and denied him a pay raise for inviting porn star Nina Hartley to speak on campus. He similarly argued at the time that it was an issue of free speech and that Hartley had a legitimate message to share with students about the pitfalls of porn. If Gao were to file a lawsuit, he may have an uphill battle, as other outlets have noted, due to past legal precedent. A 2004 Supreme Court case ruled against a San Diego police officer who sued on First Amendment grounds after being fired for selling a pornographic video of himself. Correction. This story incorrectly stated the name of Gao's wife in an earlier version. His wife is Carmen Wilson.